pass is splattering on the ground. Hey, Typhoon, thank you for the 18 months. Mousepad winner 2019, thank you for the four months. Thank you so much. Bless you. Oh, man, that fucking audio quality was something else. It's so good. I gotta thank a sugar biscuit for for uh, showing me this man. I'm obsessed with this guy. It, 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 it's so fucking weird, man. He's got he's got music videos from 2015 until now, until like 2018, and he keeps using the same women and the quality. I I can't even explain it. I I don't even know. I, I don't know how you can record that badly. <laughs> if he maybe he used the wrong file when he was uh i don't know man when he was exporting i have no fucking clue it's uh it's something else you forgot your green card listen okay i had an eu stream you eu boys you gotta you gotta uh you gotta wait at the border all right this is for us americans now we had you had your time you had your time in the sun i let the, the canadians in you know if you want to go uh through canada you know that's up to them might be tough. They kick you out after six months. All right. Oh man, I know he really did. Ugh, I love it so much, man. It's so good. It is so good. Incredible. Incredible stuff. I just, I don't understand what he's doing. Like he's playing the guitar, but there's no guitar riff in the song. He's hardly singing. Is he composing the music? Is he producing the music? I, I don't understand what's going on in this, but I love every second of it. They really do. They they look like like something that a uh, a wedding videographer would have made. <laughs> it's just uh, man, you don't see quality like that nowadays. It's a sh it's a damn shame. It's a damn shame. My God. All right, everybody, welcome to the u.s stream we had an eu stream earlier i let all the eus in i kicked all the us's out gotta kick all call, kick all the eus out now sorry guys this is for the u.s um i'm obligated by contract by law to stream for the u.s at this hour all right u.s citizens only if you got a visa maybe you can go through if you got a green card maybe uh, you're going to have to check yourself over at the at the entrance and see if that's going to allow you to do uh, to, to watch the stream, okay? You have to swipe your card in there. Swipe it and see if it lets you pass. After that, it's beyond me. Sorry. And if you sneak in, hey, that's on you. You're, you're, you're sneaking in? You're using a VPN to, to watch this stream? You know, I can't guarantee your safety. I, th you're in, It's in God's hands at that point, all right? Sorry. Sorry, guys. Uh, all right, so th we got a three-way tie here between Deadly Premonition, Real Lives, and Slasher's Keep. Uh, Deadly Premonition is very finicky. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to run it, and uh, if it runs, we're going to play it. If it doesn't, we're going to have to opt for one of the other two. Perhaps we'll have time for all three. Who knows? Who knows? Slasher's Keep is is pretty fun. Uh, it's it's interesting. It's like it's like if Doom was done in uh, uh, what is it called? Oh, God, I can't think. But it looks like, like all the all the models are flat, but they look like they're in three D. It's interesting. You can watch from the U S Embassy. I will allow this. Um, that's allowed. That's fine. But you must be at the U.S. Embassy. I need you to, to snap a photo and, and send it to my email so I can check. All right? If I don't see the American flag somewhere with, with the stream up, we're going to have a big problem here. All right? But, uh, yeah, let's give uh, Deadly Permission a try here. I did play a little of this game a while back, but my save is now dead. Because the game refused to work after a while, so <laughs> so we got to start over, unfortunately. But that should be fine. I, I wonder if I can capture this game all right. This game uh, does nothing but cause issues every time it's played. So we'll see. I wonder if we can make this run at a dis uh, decent frame rate. It's all up in the air, people. 
my peeps. How is everyone, by the way? How's your Tuesday? Oh God, I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to watch this on a uh, on my app. I can't see any of you. I can see nobody. All right. Let's see here. Let's see what the frick is going on here, guys. All right. Coming up, it's coming up. Oh wow. Beautiful music, by the way. A beautiful composition. Let me see if I can, uh. <laughs> Hell yeah! Watch the intro. I haven't seen this in forever. Welcome, Finik. Why is it? Is it really low on your end all of a sudden? I don't know what's going on. I want to hear another story. Ah. Uh, Yes. The missing? No, I have not. You've been waiting a long time for this, so... How about a special one? Video stuttering? This yeah, that's the game. This story is very strange and very nasty. <laughs> it does sound like this. What nostalgic. <laughs> Do you think you can be a good girl and listen all the way to the end? Is it a scary story? It might be. But it's also a very uh, important story. Also, I if you this don't to want to permission. hear it, I can tell you a different story. No, I want to hear it. Yeah. This way, I won't be yes, scared. If it doesn't work, please check your machine, guys. Will you turn on the TV, then? Leave the sound down, like always. Sorry, I'm still adjusting things. Now, no, okay. this is... This is important. At times, we must purge things from this world because they should not exist. Even if it means losing someone that you love. Grandpa pissing. That's my fondest memory as well. This is how people whisper, by the way. Could you wait just a little longer? Sure. This won't take long. Oh my god, the faces are so creepy in this game, I forgot. Got over here. Okay. Let's observe. A doll shaped like a fat man. It has a plate on it which reads Washington State. The fat man does? What are all these kids doing, man? Let's hear what this person has to say. Could you wait just a little longer? Let's take it. What is this? I got 200 bucks for a trading card, hell yeah. White screen. Oh my god, the running. The fucking camera is next level as well. Alright. Can't open that. How do I get out of here? It's locked. 
A dummy for hanging costumes gives me the creep somehow, though it might be useful for jackets. C. Red leaves fluttering in the air. A chandelier hanging from above. Can this riddle be solved, Zach? What the fuck are you talking? Oh my god, there is a chandelier up there. Why? Could you wait? Come on, we I've been waiting. Could you wait? How do I get out of this hell? Listen, don't talk. Are, are you from the. Excuse me, Joseph, are you from the EU? The, listen, this isn't the stream for you, man. You don't need that kind of talk in the US stream, alright? You don't need that here. What am I supposed to do now? My god. You're an American? I've never heard an American speak that way. What do I do? Could you wait? Just a little longer. The clock? I don't think I have actually. Let me check out that clock. Let me check the clock over here. Strange clock is ticking away, though the room itself makes you feel as if time has stopped. Okay, there we go. I just have to check everything. Sorry to keep you waiting. It will start soon. These kids look like Ike. It's about time to get started. Okay. Let's get started. <laughs> does he talk to himself? He Zach. like holds his yeah. This is what he does: holds his head and just Zach. talks to himself. Can you hear me? It's me, York. If you can hear my voice, could you respond? <sighs> Good. I thought you went to sleep. Zach, don't be surprised. The crime took place out in the country this time. Let's take it slow. Who's the Zack character? Okay, Zack? Okay. I guess we're Zack. Sure, that's one way of looking at it. It's loud. But it's totally wrong. Now it's fucking loud! Oh, hold on a sec. They both need each other. It's called interdependency, and they both know it. Yeah, I know. He does terrible things to Tom. Nasty. He's just looking this up in his car. But that's fine, as long as that's what Tom wants. Think of it. His actions. He's always asking for it. It's his partner's job to fulfill that need, and Jerry knows that. Proof? Well, in the Tom and Jerry show, they live with each other. Alright, if you're making burgers, you're allowed. Hello? You've just become an American. Hello? You just got your passport. Zach, I can't believe the Bureau still can't get me a satellite phone. Network arrow. These Network? These are making me go to another town in the boondocks again. Well... I'll be a happy camper, even if it ends up being a waste of time. At the very least, it would get me cranked. That's so cool. Yeah. Right, Zach? The perpetrator from the last case really was something. Who'd have thought there'd be razors laced into your nails? Crazy. Just crazy. Well, at least I now have a scar to show off. See this? All right, yeah, so you're in. You made it into America. You're crazy. Don't you agree, Zach? Why does the top of that say no smoking? The top of the lighter <laughs> has a no cigarettes uh, decal. Oh shit! Oh my god! 
dude. He's a great driver. <laughs> Jesus Christ! Man, they, they just don't make games like this anymore. This is completely batshit insane. I <laughs> know they were! Those were monkey sounds! Oh, not the laptop. Yeah, he's dropping everything. At least the car is okay. That car sustained less damage than mine did. Than mine did. Can't fucking believe it. The car's fine. Hmm. Damn. Can't even smoke after that. There we go. Zach? There How is it burning behind well. him? But the car is fine. How did this happen? Also, that, that's that's the back of the car. I don't know. I don't know what's going on, man. It's just a deadly premonition. What is this? Save point? Steel pipe. Alright, let's do it. Where's my toolbox? How do I equip? my pistol. Do I have ammunition for this? Oh yeah, I do. I'm good. Uh Okay. I just did. I don't know if I unequipped, but all of a sudden I don't have my gun equipped anymore. <laughs> Got these menus. Something else. Wait, no, I do have it equipped. What the fuck? What happened? Why isn't it out anymore? Gun? All right, never mind. Let's let's just keep going. Jesus! Snoochums, thank you for the... Chicken fell on the ground. Look, I'm damaged. The chicken fell on the ground. Now I have to clean the chicken. Oh, it's space that equips the gun, apparently. Got a medal. Some agent honor. Man, it's... It's unfortunate. This whole forest is on fire. My car's fine. Tough luck. Have to leave you here, old buddy. Damn, poor car. Everything's on fire but the car. Do I have to break this? Is that how this works? I'm assuming that's what I have to do. I'm assuming this is what we do. We we hit. Just cut it down, no big deal. I got another medal for that. Five bucks, baby. Hell yeah. Five buckaroos. I'd love to go fishing. Why is it that all Japanese games have fishing involved? Like fishing mini games, I just love it. Looks like we're being welcomed. Zach, I'll <laughs> let you handle the meet and greet. Okay. Don't know what we just did, but it's fine. Zach's gonna take care of it. Am I gonna get attacked by dogs? Or are those squirrel noises? It's gonna be a dog, isn't it? Oh no! Huh? There's an earthquake going on right now. <laughs> uh, 
So much for my hopes for a peaceful picnic. <laughs> That's what he has to say after seeing a dead dog. Well, this is gonna be a pain in the ass. Jesus Christ, my phone won't stay up. Now this is what I don't get. Is he hallucinating all this? Are there actually fucking zombies here? No, he's gotta be hallucinating. What? what? Alright, we're gonna take a can of pickles. The pickle. Uh, the pickle. Turn on the generator. Who doesn't love a good canned pickle? Do canned pickles exist? <laughs> I just don't... Why would you ever put a pickle anywhere other than a jar? Oh, hell yeah. Okay. Alright, we got a mysterious shadow. This is a key item? Photo of zombie? Okay. I think I could pull this off. Uh... Yes. Oh my god, the aiming is next level, man. Oh my fuck. Holy shit. Is he dead? Okay, he's dead. We're good. <laughs> That's an actual band-aid! Oh, this zombie just really hurt my thumb. Can you move your- Oh my god, why can't I move this mouse? Alright, we got him. I don't know if this is a feature, but my my mouse is freezing every time I aim. And I'm trying to, like, hit it off the screen in order to make it work. Let's start profiling here. Let's profile this creature. A lot of crazy situations, but that one, that one takes the cake. We just killed three First people, and he's fine with it. So directly, Zach, can you give me a logical explanation about what that was? Never mind, don't answer. Life is fun because of the mysteries, right, Zach? Okay. Is this the save point over here? Oh yeah, it is. Okay. The only thing that would make this better is if he gets sucked into the phone, like in the Matrix. We got a lollipop? Oh, there we go. It's it's David Cage if the if David Cage wasn't trying to be melodramatic. Uh he was just fucking insane. Can I- why can't I move this? It's not letting me aim. That's all it let me do. I couldn't aim at her head. The game said no. The game told me I have to shoot the butt. I had no choice. This is what I mean. Like, sometimes this game doesn't work. Oh shit. And sometimes this game just doesn't let you aim at all. It's just convenient sometimes... It's right at the head. Is there like auto aim? Is there like an aim assist? By default? My god, I can't even tell what these are. Profiling options. Let's try options. Camera setting, aim setting. Invert crosshair? Right now that's normal. I 
Alright, never mind. Sometimes it auto aims, sometimes it aims at the butt. So I don't know what to think. Can can I please move my gun? Or do I have to shoot the butt? Do I have not have a choice? I don't have a controller plugged in, no. It's <laughs> just gonna make me shoot the butt! Three fucking bullets for a butt shot. Oh my god. And I'm assuming melee is probably a, a chore, no? Oh wait, hold on, I might be able to hit her in the head. There we go. All she has to do is move a little bit. Let's get this metal over here. What was that, 30 bucks? Whew! Hell yeah! some money from that baby. It's pretty good. I only do butt shots in this game. It's it's really the only fair way to play. Now I have to run. This is pretty interesting. I have to run at an angle in order to try to fucking shoot at the head. Can you bend backwards, please? Come on, bend backwards like that other guy was. I might be able to... Now I can fucking aim. No, no, I can't. It's like, if she's in focus, it doesn't let me look around. Just get three butt shots in there. Easy kill. Easy butt kill. <laughs> fucking band-aid. <laughs> Imagine you're just bleeding out and you have to use an entire box of band-aids to save your own life. I wonder if the puss shot is as effective. It is, actually. Stop it, guys. Can look as has it. Sao Asian, thank you so much for that sub. Bless your heart. I don't know. I don't know what the point of this is, so I'm just not even gonna bother with it. Can I reload? Do I have? Oh shit, I do have. Okay. What are you touching? Generator looks really bad, Zach. <laughs> Why is he touching himself like that? I think the killer really had a grudge against it. Right, good thing I fucking took a picture of this. I'm solving this little by little. I'm gonna profile this some more. I don't understand what we're trying to do here. Was that a cheeseburger? <laughs> what does that have to do with everything? A cheeseburger fits into huh? this? Zach, let's try to find a way to fix this mess. Alright, we got the fuse box. Just ripped it right out. Are there things in these? Can I get items from this? Or money? Oh shit, man. Hold on, we got an easy shot here. Might not even have to do the classic butt shot. Might be able to shoot the head. There we go. So I've come to terms with the fact that I'm I'm just not going to be able to... Um, I'm not going to be able to always hit people in the head. Can this break? I could throw away my knife. Oh boy. Right, there's nothing there. That's true. Cheeseburger does equal American. This just proves this is an American game. Looks like the door wasn't locked. What? But I just had trouble opening it. Damn, dude. She fucking teleported. <laughs> Alright, we're good. She dead. We got the fuse box. There's a hell of a lot of generators here. There we go. It's solved. Fixed. Power in the area should be much more stable now. Let's hurry ahead, Zach. Let's. Please, let's. Do I have to backtrack now? Do a little push shot here. <laughs> Did 
These voices. They're very good. He just shielded his... She shielded her... Uh, vagina. From the bullet. They're smart. They're learning. Alright, hold on. I'm gonna give him the... Oh! Bullseye. Bullseye. Give him the old headshot. Another medal for me. Got some Agent Honor over here. <laughs> she just stood there and took it. You don't want to die? I th baby, I think you're too far gone already. I think it's a little late for that. Just sank into the ground. This place sucks. I'm not getting good vibes from this place. I think this place is not good. Oh shit. Whoa! Where'd these people come from? Let's just pick up a bandage. Band-aid. A, fle a flexible fabric band-aid. Oh, shit. Oh god, I'm, I'm fucking stuck! Yes. Amazing. <laughs> Just said amazing. Sorry, buddy, that wasn't a very good shot. Where did they come from? Oh, fuck! Go. Got him in the pingus, he's fine. He's down. <laughs> it's so exaggerated. Oh shit, there he is. Oh fuck! I didn't know there was gonna be a QTE. No! Oh shit. Oh shit! No! Okay. Well, we died. Yes, please end my game. That's what I'd like to do. After all that, let me just end it for good. Do I have to do all that over again? What the fuck? Alright. Gonna do as many puss shots as I possibly can. Butt shots, puss shots. Anything to get ahead. There we go. This guy's easy. You remember this guy? Amazing. Is this supposed to happen? Are they supposed to be glitching out and running towards me? Or is that total happenstance that that happened? My worst enemy appears. This time I'm ready for him. I know what I have to hit. Oh fuck! I, I missed it again! Come on! I'm hitting it already! I can't possibly die! It's impossible. It's impossible to die. <laughs> he just walks away. That's it. Yeah, just the, the, the investigation was the only thing that really mattered in the end. There we go. We're out of here. Okay. Huh? <laughs> just picked it up off the ground. Just, just a vein. We're gonna do a little profiling here. Here we go. Profiling start. Cheeseburger. Cheeseburger. Dog. Hold on, you have to eat in this game? There's a hunger meter? Holy shit. This game is way ahead of its time. This is a survival game.
There's definitely something in this town. Nah, I, feel it, I doubt it. My coffee warned me about it. What? <laughs> Yesterday morning, the milk I poured in my coffee made a sign. It was spoiled. It said, Tomorrow you'll arrive in a place that will change your fate. That's what he perceived from rotten milk. Let us save. Hey, can I call a taxi or something? That's a long way to run. 500 yards. Just running with my gun out. That's how I, that's how I demand authority. Grabbing medals along the way. I demand authority. I demand respect. Should be a QTE for a, is that a squirrel. Oh, okay, I thought I thought it was something else. There should be a QTE for going on the bridge, and someone r tries to run you over, and you dodge them. But you don't just dodge them because everything has to be gratuitous in this game. You you just jump on the hood and surf on the car. I love that band aids are actual first aid kits in this game. It's fantastic. There she is. Now you were very late. How the fuck do you know who I am? <laughs> I didn't think you'd keep me waiting in the rain for so long. FBI special. <laughs> he just points it at her face. Clearly she recognizes him. He didn't need to do that. Calls me. Agent York? Good, that's good. Are you the sheriff? Good, you can speak. Uh, no, I'm Deputy Sheriff Emily Wyatt. George, he's the sheriff. He went looking for you, actually. He should be back soon. I see. You're not gonna explain if that your I'm car asking, is on fire? Walk all the way here. My car broke down. That's all. It it, it didn't break down. There there's a forest fire happening somewhere right now. This is gonna devastate this land. It it didn't break down. She's easy on the eyes. He's just gonna say this in front of Definitely her. Definitely worth a trip to the primitive world. By the way, don't mention anything about what happened out there. She'll think you're a psycho. <laughs> she won't think you're a psycho because you're whispering in front of her about her. Welcome. What the fuck? She didn't hear any of this? I'm the sheriff, George Woodman. I like Call this guy already. George. Call me Woodman. FBI Special Agent Francis York Morgan. Please, just call me York. That's what everyone calls me. I'll call you Francis. Could you tell me why the FBI is so interested in a small town homicide? <laughs> True. Let's just say it's a personal interest in killers of young women. I think it was actually inspired by Twin Peaks. Sample cases to help me with my profile. Both are superior but if Twin Peaks made no fucking sense... You can remain in command. You don't have a problem with this, do you? No. No problem. Just want to set things straight. Our small town has its share of problems. I'm the one fixing them one by one, <laughs> and maintaining peace and order. You can have. Why is he circling him like this? But I need you to understand that. <clears throat> of course. Of course. By the way, George, I had a little accident with my car. Could you send someone to take care of it? You know where it is, even? Oh, and my clothes and luggage are still inside. Points a cigarette in his face. All right. Don't worry. He's got a scar, too. I'll get my assistant, Thomas, to take care of it. Sheriffs have assistants. Do you need anything else? Thanks. That'll be all. Well, he puts the cigarette out on his face. At the hotel. Then I'll join you on your investigation. Don't know how to save it. But, uh, we really don't need your help. Oh, Damn. Like some of your corrupt city police officers, I play it by the book. I hope you'll come to appreciate that, Agent Morgan. I told you to call me York. And we'll handle the investigation. You just think of this as a vacation. Take it easy. 
Enjoy the nature here. You don't have to be a tree worshiper. I wonder if they have a, a mean cherry pie. Zach, let's reassess the situation. There is there no such a thing as a tree worshiper? As far <laughs> Did he mean tree hugger? I don't think I've ever heard someone called a tree worshiper. I love what? I love mom? Oh god, he's skidding into the other lane. Hell yeah. I killed 31 enemies? I don't, it doesn't feel like that many. Fuck yeah, 200 bucks, baby. 970 bucks, baby. Zach view the investigation. These puppies are making me go to another <laughs> town in the boondocks again. I didn't think you'd keep me waiting in the rain for so long. Welcome to Greenville. I'm the sheriff, George Woodman. <laughs> George, there's definitely something. I wish you would have said, "Call me Woodman." <laughs> you feel it, Zach? My coffee warned me about it. <laughs> I fucking love this shit. It's broken. I've been using that one for a long time. Why didn't you get it repaired? This TV is important to you, right? It's got some memories attached to it, sure. I used to watch movies on this thing with your grandma all the time. Grandma likes Who is this old man? Of course she did. Everyone loves movies, right? I love movies too. There's so I've much in common. I've never been to a movie theater though. You don't want to go to those overpriced. Uh, you'll just waste all your money there. Hell yeah, donut. Nice. Krispy Kreme? Duncan? Which one? Angel Isaac. Oh boy. <laughs> Here we go. York. York. Yes. You just oh Okay. Don't breathe. Hold your breath. They can't see you if you hold your breath. Hurry. Like this. Sounds Cover like bullshit to me. This kid's a fucking liar. <laughs> Do we also have to sneak? Is that Jared Leto's Joker? Missing the tattoos though. Must be an early concept. <laughs> Why is this going on for so long? Just keep moving! <laughs> the fuck are you doing? We're still pretty close to him. Who are you? It's a mouthful. <laughs> oh, 
Awesome. It's a good segue. Answers exactly the questions I was curious about. Jesus Christ, how big is this bed? Four people can fit in this. Motherfucker has six six pillows. Man, the Great Northern is really upgraded. Zach, the symbolism in my dreams continues to intensify. It's a nice morning cigarette. A forest of red trees. A carpet with red leaves. A strange doll. And twin angels. But that child is what bothers me the most. I swear I've seen him before. I just can't remember where. I think it's a little York. Well, it'll probably come back to me eventually. Probably. You guys remember that now, waterfall? We need coffee. Let's get. What? Let's head to the cafeteria. What the I fuck is going on with my I tie? Have some real coffee. I really <laughs> need some coffee. Then we can head to the sheriff's office. Oh, there we go. We fixed it. It's fine. There's a proper procedure for like everything. The, right the tie right? has physics. What is this? Is this how we save? The toolbox. What does this do? Save here. Oh, wow. Looks almost brand new. No problem. No problem. He doesn't really look like a, like a detective now. He looks like a used car salesman. Don't know if I would trust this guy as much. Let's shave a little bit. Thirty-three yards. Is that where I'm supposed to be going? Uh, I can't take a shower. Can I use toilet? Hold on a second. Where's the toilet? Is there a separate room for the toilet? There can't be. It can't possibly be. They've got a shower. They okay. Th this is how wasteful this room is. They've got a shower. There's got to be a toilet in there. There's a fucking toilet room. They've got a half bath within a bathroom. Why? <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why is this happening? This makes no fucking sense. They've got a bathroom that has a what? This is this is really bugging me, man. They've got a, a separate room for the shower. They've got a bath in the other room with a sink. Then they've got a half bath with a toilet and a sink within the bathroom. I've never seen something so inexplicable. This is very strange design. I, I want to visit this hotel. <laughs> they, they more, like Imagine buying a house, right? Or renting an apartment. And they're like, yeah, there's, there's one and a half baths. And you're like, oh, cool. What what is the one of the bathrooms in the in the bedroom? No, it's in the bathroom. Just just smush it all together. <laughs> you go to the bathroom and find a bath and another half bath <laughs> within the same bathroom. Where am I fucking going? Am I going downstairs? Okay, let's see here. I remember there's just a ridiculous, unnecessary amount of rooms in this uh, in this game. That's true. Doors do add value. Oh, what can we buy here? Lollipop crackers. That's it. Twenty-four forty. Excuse me. Thirty-five bucks for some cracker. Get the fuck out of here. What is this, Trader Joe's? I didn't realize I was I was shopping in in a Whole Foods vending machine. Fuck me. 
Jesus Christ, I'm, I'm making hardly any wages if if a, if a cup of coffee's thirty one dollars. My God, this government shutdown's insane. What? Good morning, Mr. Morgan. Your breakfast is ready. <laughs> oh my god, why are you walking like that? Hello, Polly. Thank is your you, back Mrs. okay? Polly Oxford. Just Polly is fine. Well then. Thank you, Polly. I'm starving. That makes no sense, Kitsu. Is everything all right, Mr. Neither th neither does this table. Yes. It's delicious, Polly. My compliments to the chef. I'm hoping my cooking will bring back repeat guests. Honestly, though, what it's the been fuck? a while since anyone has stayed here. I couldn't help but <laughs> What did she just do? Aside from this you, looks like a North Korean no other dining hall. Around. What's that? <laughs> the salt in that white shaker there. Thank you. I was wondering if there were any other guests or workers here. Oh, no, no one else. My husband and I used to run this place, but he's in heaven now. Oh, You've been peace. working here alone since then. Must be hard by yourself. Oh my, we're all out of pepper. I'm very sorry. Nothing I said could remotely have been by yourself. misconstrued well, yes, asking I for suppose. pepper. I could just live on my pension. But you I should use some of that pension for a hearing aid. Running a hotel aid. is kind of like a hobby of mine. That's nice. Polly, it might help to hear you better if you could sit a little closer. Oh my, Mr. Morgan. You're embarrassing me. So early in the day, too. I think I'm a little too old for you. And I still love my departed husband. May God rest his soul. <laughs> what the fuck? I appreciate the invitation, but I'm fine over here. Polly... I can hardly hear you from all the way over there. You're exaggerating. This is fun. Bitch, you couldn't even hear me. To be all clumped together with such a large table and cafeteria. We have to make use of all this space. <sighs> now tell me, that wound on your face, what happened? Let's just say I had some trouble during the last case I was working on. I'm sure it'll heal. We've got it's plenty of bandages. We can make it oh heal. Oh my. Well, there's no need to be the tough guy here. I want you to be able to relax here. I've prepared a special room for you. A famous rock star. <laughs> this is just a run-on sentence at this room, point. You know. Really? <laughs> I feel honored. If you need anything, anything at all, just let me know. I'll help you out in any way I can. Zach, the lady is offering to help. <laughs> Do you want to ask her about the town? Yes. Say, Polly, what can you tell me about this town? Well, I'm Zach. let me see. You might know <laughs> that the town is called Greenvale. Really? It's here quite often, but it's a nice place, surrounded with nature. It was a big and prospering. She starts smoking in her so in her fucking ago. hotel. We used to have a population of over six thousand people. The loud music is just to make you uh, more immersed in the fact that you can't hear this woman. That's why this place is so big for such a small community. I have so many fond memories from back then. I suppose the clock on the community center is quite famous too. Oh yeah? Clock? Oh yes, it's lovely. It rings in the morning and at night to oh, let wow. the whole town know the time. You'll hear it many times. <laughs> you just told me the stay. function of a clock. It's Thank a you. Beautiful sound, and you'll love it too. I think. I look forward. You won't to believe this. It, it will tell Anything the time. Anything else you'd like to know about? She's spread out. Look at this stuff. I just put out my cigarette and well, my Mr. food. Well, Mr. Morgan, I'd better start cleaning up. You just take it easy. I'll bring your coffee out in a moment. Thank you, Polly. I have to warn you, though. I okay. am very particular about my coffee. The very best you have, please. I understand. I'll be right back with it. And bring me some cherry pie. Well, I'm doing absolutely doing a 100% run. That's a lot of milk.
What? <laughs> Did you see that, Zack? Clear as a crisp spring morning. F. K. Fuck. In the coffin. Fuck. I knew I could count on it. Never fails. <laughs> He's got such a Let's beautiful smile. My god, this is a game about Georgie. Not only is there coffee involved, but it said FK. Fuck. Hashtag FCK in the coffee here. How much is coffee? Oh, can I just have it? Hell yeah, dude. Another cup? For free? York is a good man. Lucky item lighter. There's well, always trouble heading my way in this job. He never leaves home without that, so I think but we'll, I'm always we'll be up okay. for a little excitement too. Oh, I guess I'm just telling my fortune this whole time. Theme park. Give me two different fortunes for the There's same a theme thing. Theme park in this town, though. Damn. All that good luck is just slipping away. But I think I'll have a thrilling enough time right here anyway. I agree. Alright, enough coffee. Are there piss mechanics in this game? That's all I need to know. I love how he runs. <laughs> oh, hi. You need anything you can find me by the front desk. I sell daily goods. Who the sales go to, aren't you? Yes, that's right. Coffee comes as a set with the breakfast. Don't worry, the service here is just as good as the, an, any fancy city hotel. Great, thank you. What does she have? She's got coffee. What? How come I have to pay for coffee if I could just get it for free over there? Stabilizer, cigarette, a heavy cigarette, huh? Do we have a light cigarette? Cheddar cheese. Oh shit! Should I go fishing? Yes. I just got a rod. Hell yeah. Got a normal worm. Why does it look like a Cheeto? Let's get one more. Just got great posture. It either looks like a Cheeto or it looks like a, a rigatone. I'd love to go fishing today. It's a lovely day. Perfect season for fishing. I know, it's a lot of money. I spent a third of my paycheck on this. Oh, I got 210 bucks though. sell the fish for a thousand dollars a piece turkey sandwich that, that thing's that thing's purple that's not turkey that's cabbage a police car our office is open from nine to, to five Hell yeah. Don't be late. So we have King George to thank for preparing a car for me. Good nickname. A pleasant surprise, eh, Zach? Let's take it for a spin. I have to tell you, Zach, this place simply amazes me. <laughs> the keys were left on the front hood. And nobody stole the car. This Valley. really is like this is Twin Peaks, this viewed through a lens of insanity needs. and regurgitated Valleys. to a Japanese audience. Let's head over to the sheriff's department. Okay, I, I I got that. The master key. Oh my fuck. Oh my god, the driving is so smooth. So crisp. Oh 
my god, no, it's not. It's too crisp. Oh my god! The handbrake makes you spin, holy shit! That's something else. So, Zach, about those bonus features in TBDs nowadays. You know, the ones from the 80s have almost no bonus material. Even if they do, it's a trailer and the visual quality is pretty bad. Well, that visual quality is a good reminder of those days. So many new audio and visual appliances were coming out back then. Do you remember the first video deck we bought? We bought it to record one of the Star Wars movies on TV. Oh, hell yeah. remember when that video store opened, we spent hours there. Just trying to find a good movie to rent. There weren't that many to choose from back then. I remember renting some really bad ones after reading those back cover taglines. Hey, remember? Attack of the Killer Tomatoes, filmed in 1978. Produced, directed, written, and edited by John, John DeBello. DeBello. It was really awful, but for some reason I still remember it pretty well. Oh my fuck. It had so many sequels, and the original was re-released in 95. You want to see me the drift? seven minute long theatrical release bumped up to a whopping 90 minutes. But that was... Hmm? Zach, we'll finish our chat later. Let's take a walk around here. <laughs> can I can I take yeah, any car? Is there something here that you want to check out? We're supposed to go through Anna Graham's file at the sheriff's office, but okay, if you want to act on a hunch, then I'm with you. These wheels are just going underground. It did kind of sound like something from Super Mario. I've never seen neon signs used for a general store before. Kind of an odd choice. Oh, hell yeah. What is this store? A bookstore? No, a sandwich shop. Hell yeah. Got a burger boy out front. Zach. Picking up from where we left off. So, Zach. About those bonus features in DVDs now. <laughs> you know, the ones from the 80s have almost no bonus material. Even if they do, it's a trailer and the visual... Oh, Zach, we're here. Hup. Let's continue our chat later. Welcome to Greenvale. Welcome to Green Peaks. That's one fine building for such a small town. The exterior woodwork is spectacular. Don't you agree, Zach? Love these textures so much. <laughs> Everything is so flat. <laughs> Country ham! A whole ham? What am I, big man gaming? <sighs> hey, Andy. I mean, what's your name? Uh, uh... Oh my god! Pleasure to meet you, Agent Morgan. We've been expecting you. I think I'm this Thomas hitting McClain, on me. the sheriff's assistant. <sighs> FBI you got a badge. How are you an assistant? Morgan. Please just call me York. It's what everyone else calls me. Very well then, Agent, Agent York. I believe I owe you a thank you for retrieving my belongings from my car. Thanks. Oh, no, no. Just doing my job. I just, well, I want to help do everything. He's the killer. The investigation. He's the killer. I just can't believe Anna was murdered. He's suspicious. She was such a bright and lovely girl. Oh, that's who Did we're looking at. Well? well, no, not really. But it's a very small town. I think we should start this investigation at One Eye Jacks. It's just that this is the first really big case I've ever seen. Let me speak to her father. I understand. Just I'll solve this quick. Can I have a look at Anna's file now? Y yes, of course. The sheriff told me to let you through to the meeting room, but I've lost the key to the cabinet where the files are. Why don't you take a look around while I go look for it? Okay. Let me know when things okay. are ready. <laughs> I run. So, Thomas appears to be the kind and sensitive type. Oh my god. Totally at odds with Did the you just monarch. call him a homosexual? Almost a good setting for a cartoon. <laughs> the soundtrack is fucking great, too. Kitchen room? Let's go to the kitchen room. 
We got coffee over here. I'm just gonna shave in the kitchen real quick, everybody. No big deal. Right next to the stew. It's great. We've got the stew on the left, coffee on the right, beard shavings right in the middle. And I'll be damned if I'm flushing that sink, if I'm cleaning that out. Let's get a nice dumbbell. Zach, there's a name written on this dumbbell. Arnold. I haven't met anyone by that name yet. Oh my god. Could it be the owner of this dumbbell? Could it be the Schwarzenegger? What do you think, Zach? I'm just going to take this with me. Just gonna, just gonna bring that along. Gray squirrel. <laughs> just, it's called gray squirrel crease, but it's just a squirrel keychain. <laughs> what the fuck? Is, that is not a turkey sandwich. That's a fucking piece of cabbage in there. What the fuck? What's going on over here? This person probably has nothing to do with the investigation. This person. Let's go to the material room. Nice sandwich with some blue sauce in it. Agent York, did you find the key? Is it this one? You found the key. Is this the one you were looking for? Ah, uh, no, this is a gray squirrel. Sorry, that's not the key. Nothing particularly special about the gray squirrel, I'm afraid. You can find them in the US, Canada, and in England too. What? A gray squirrel. What was I thinking? But, but there's a fucking a key on it! Squirrel right now. Oh, a southern flying squirrel. Okay, so they're all squirrels. What the fuck? Oh my lord. Alright, let's find some squirrels here. How big is this place? How difficult is it gonna be to find this squirrel? I know, it's even it's even got a a code to it. Very advanced. Very cool. What you wanna bet I can shoot this easily with my gun. My handgun. The squirrel here. Striped squirrel. That's not it either. What did he say? Which squirrel did he say? I don't think it's a striped one, is it? Uh. Most wanted. I can't believe a police officer and his dog are the most wanted. Uh. This person probably has nothing to do with the other. <laughs> he just refers to every officer as a person. It's like, ah, this guy. Southern Great Flying Squirrel. Okay. I'm just gonna sleep in a cell. There's an option to sleep in one of these cells. I love it, man. Just leave all the doors open, let the in inmates out, give them some fresh air. Hopefully we'll bring we bring in the cope. Yeah, God damn, I can't talk. Hopefully we'll be bringing in the culprit soon, though that'll mean the end of this little vacation here. This guy's very upset. A metal in there. Yeah, I gotta sleep it off. How many squirrels are there? Maybe that's the one. That's a flying squirrel. You're Canadian! Get the heck out of here! Well, actually, I let Canadians in. So you're safe for today. I better not see you here tomorrow. If it's a U.S. only stream, I'll be wa I'll be looking for you, Brevima. I'll be looking for you. You just watch yourself. You 
Better not be, I swear to God. Better not. I wonder if you can enter every room here. Let's check out the storage. Thank you so much, IDF. That's all I ask. If you're a Euro European ass that you please. There's another one. Was this the one? The pointy tailed? How many fucking flying squirrels are there? If you get a stream visa, we're perfectly square. But I swear to god, if you watch this stream illegally, I'll be pretty peeved. And I'll let you know it. I'm not gonna keep quiet about it. Oh my god, Iron Body. Iron body? What just happened? I just opened this and nothing happened. Maybe that's the one. Yeah, you can make a burger and, and I'll let you in. Burger's enough. Let's save this real quick. Looking for all these squirrels. That's it, man. That's it. Now you're torrenting. I've had enough. Someone can get him out of here. We got an agent in here? We've got a cyber trooper in here to get him out of here? What's up, Emily? Hi. Could you perhaps show me around the officer? The office before the meeting starts? Got my hands full. All right. I'll stick you to the cabinet. Got 12 bucks for just talking to a lady. God, I wish I could get paid to talk to women in real life. Got George in there? Georgie? Why can't I open this? Uh, why does it say number four, George? <laughs> George, do you work out every day? Uh, of course, CJ. Uh, Exercise keeps me healthy. I haven't missed a day since I started. That's not house. true, Kando. Oh, you know impressive. it. Remind me to get more exercise. I'm streaming from Mendoza, Argentina. But I can't do my. I'm living with my mother today, without Arnold. I haven't seen Arnold around since yesterday. Arnold. He's a training buddy of mine. His partner Sylvester misses him too. If you see Arnold around, let me know, will you? Who the fuck is Arnold, man? Finish my workout menu without him. Okay. I'll keep an eye out for him. <laughs> Lost Arnold. <laughs> What's that music too? All right. <laughs> Lost my Arnold. Excuse me, please. You gotta find Arnold. Just gonna check out every room. Find every squirrel. Tell you one thing, if there's no squirrels in sight, and I'm definitely gonna get frostbite. Sylvester's <laughs> alive. <laughs> oh, I can't go in the women's bathroom? Come on. I can't even piss in this game? What are you fucking kidding me? What year did this come out? Are you are you fucking joshing me right now? Can't piss? <laughs> what a joke. What a joke and a half. Yes, I found the key. With the pointy. Here it is. You found the key. I think so. Is this it? Take a look at it. Ah. Uh, you don't know your squirrels, do you? This isn't the right key holder. This is a Siberian flying squirrel. It's closer to oh a land-based squirrel. More, the Siberian more... flying squirrel is larger than the southern flying squirrel and has a standing tail while the southern has a hanging tail. Oh my lord. But we're looking for a southern flying squirrel right now. 
sure do know a lot about squirrels. Sure does. Alright, which one's the fucking southern flying squirrel? You said it had a hanging tail, right? Striped, curvy-tailed... How about this one? You found the key! That's the right one? <laughs> yes! A southern flying squirrel. Thank you so much. I'll bring the files right in, so... What are the other me. keys for? Okay. I'll be waiting for you. Well, Zach, we just got here, and we have <laughs> the big case already. Stop saluting me! I didn't serve. What is the that? The victim's name was Anna Graham. Age is that a dead tree painting? Graduated from high school this year. Her dream was Look, to move out to the city I slept through the squirrel lesson, okay? But for the time being, she was working in the A and G diner here in town. She lived with her mother Sally. Anna's father died. I've never seen Sally spell that when she way. Was a child. What is that? Her mother the is unemployed. What the fuck is that? What the fuck kind of donut is that? Accident. What? It's a donut burger. After all, it's a small town with a low cost of living. Financially, they seem to get by fine, and they led normal lives. A normal life is exactly what a curious teenager doesn't want. It's, it's my donut ashtray. Sense, it's like they tried to do the double donut thing from Twin Peaks, but they're like, you know what? We're just going to make the donut a lot thicker. <laughs> She's pretty pissed City about that. Folk, huh? No. No, I take that back. All of them can't be as bad as him. And some should have better manners. Huh. Talking shit? This is a good biscuit. That is not a biscuit! I tasted a biscuit this delicious. There's no such thing as a biscuit with a hole Where in the, the middle. Can I get these? Fuck off. Well, actually... I... Well... I... I baked them myself. Mm. That's amazing. What are you doing in lawn? What the fuck?! I'm very particular about biscuits, I'll have you know. The balance of milk and butter you've achieved here. Oh my. Agent Morgan. This this is ready. something else. You are welcome to accompany me to the Greenvale General Hospital. Emily, okay. You come too. Thomas, come on, Em. Stay here and tidy up these files. Y yes, sir. We're going to stay use the here car and tidy outside. up these squirrels. Let's get going. You might do such a small town police investigation, but our inspections are thorough and solid. I'm hoping you won't slow us down. Am I flipping him off? <laughs> I just flipped him off, dude. How much money do I get for this? Hell yeah. 200 bucks? Hell yeah, man. I'm making some bank right now. I got biscuit. Coffee black. Why not white coffee? Why not White Panther? I'm just gonna eat a raw oh, no, 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 I'm not gonna do that. I'm not that desperate. I'll eat a biscuit with a hole in it, but I'm not gonna eat a raw potato. Oh wow. I'm gonna eat a whole bass. The Greenvale General Hospital is down the road by the lake. It's too far to walk. Come on, get in the car. If I'm riding in a car, George, I prefer to be the driver. Can you provide a car for me? What are you talking about? You don't even know how to get there. <laughs> Which is another good reason for me to drive, George. I need to learn my way around town. Oh, man. Very well. You're the one who gave me a car! With you. I want to keep an eye on you. Fair enough. Aren't I above him? I'm with the FBI. Just thing, Agent Why is he Morgan, giving so much your sass? in this case is limited. That means you don't have to learn your way around town. What? George. We'd better get moving. The hospital closes at 2100. No, yeah, it's it's 12 o'clock right now. Only got nine hours. Agent Morgan, get us there quickly, but drive within the speed limit. Just because you have a badge doesn't mean you can drive like a maniac. Yes, it does. George, what are you, his mother? Yeah, George. We just need to get the autopsy results. Agent York isn't accustomed to the town yet. Give him a little slack. Oh, gotcha. Mm. 
We can't use that FBI charm. Well then, Agent. That Nick, FBI let's strong begin. arm. Sure. Sounds good. Gotta turn these wipers on, man. How do we turn on wipers? Can we look at the controls here? Cruel production. Cruel? It's the strangest wording, I, wording I, I've ever read. Oh my god. I think I'm blind. Alright. Don't worry, we're going the speed limit. What is it, 50? What is it, 70? What? Uh, what did I hit? That's a fucking... It's a fucking sidewalk. Alright. Where do I fucking go? I need a shortcut around here. Wait, no, there's like a... There's like a dirt road up there. There's a con an old country road up there. Let's take that one. Well, maybe not. Maybe yes? Hell yeah, here we go. See? It's all about shortcuts in games like these. Especially the ones that lead you the wrong direction. How do I even put the sirens on? I think I just put on the turn signal. <laughs> Which is pretty incredible. I'll turn eventually. We got it. Oh. Did it just get turned around? Oh, okay. There's a GPS in this fucking thing. What a shortcut, Siri. God. I'm never getting out of here, man. Too many fences around here. Agent Morgan, I can't help noticing you prefer to work alone. Most of the time, yes. Don't you get lonely, flying all over the country alone? I must say, I've never felt lonely. Are you married? Unfortunately, relationships hey, are you and I are fleeting strangers. I don't get on very well with women. You might. Hmm? Hold on. Zach, we'll finish our chat later. <laughs> he says we'll this in front of him. Here. <laughs> talking to her. Hey, Zach. If you're wandering off, then we'll go on ahead. We don't have time to mess around. I wanted to okay. save my. I'll meet up with you later. Agent York, the hospital closes at 2100. Please make it inside before then. I just wanted to save, man. Why do I- why am I wearing a- an FBI poncho all of a sudden? Hell yeah, Sugar Biscuit. I'm so glad you were able to make the flight. Love to do this. Hold on a second. I see how to get there now. See, this is back when you had to look at maps. You didn't have these GPSs just plotting the course for you. 90s kids know. No. 90s kids know all about the S and map. And map quest. That's right.
is the hospital? What time is it? Oh, it's it's 10 a.m. They're telling me it closes at 9. Fucking hell, man. I couldn't have more time if I tried. Love this poncho. Agent Morgan, have you no respect for rules and protocol? What? We were waiting for you, and now you try to go in by yourself. Oh, George, I didn't see you in the parking lot, so I thought I'd wait inside. <laughs> now on. These fucking poses, holy shit. Why are you standing in the rain? Just come inside. Fuck me, man. He probably just got lost on his way here and rushed in. Right, Agent York? Yeah, that's it. Let's go inside then. She's the killer. Hello, Sheriff. Oof. Oh boy. Freckly Fiona? That's her name? <laughs> Hi there, Fiona. Where hey there, Freckly. Do you know where he is? I think Dr. Johnson is in the computer room. A computer room? In a hospital? <laughs> nice to meet you, Mr. FBI agent. The computer room is where our employees share a computer. Very nice to meet you. She looks like she's wearing an I'm asshole on her head. Agent I'm sorry to say that, but that's the first thing that came to mind. <laughs> she's got a butthole on her head. None of the police in this town wear cologne. That is a rectum. Besides, that scar on your face is the biggest rumor in town. Rumors get exaggerated as they spread, even in the countryside. What's that you're reading, if I may ask? Liar's House. <laughs> Author unknown. You haven't heard of this yet? It's a recent bestseller mystery. It's set in the U.S., a oh, small my favorite country. North American town close to the Canadian border. A peaceful, traditional place. However, that peaceful town is shattered by a terrible crime. Oh, yeah? The murder of a local girl. And that Sounds like a show I've watched. And sadness to everyone in town. Wow. Everyone feels the seditious, heinous, evil still lurking, alive. Yes, much like the situation right now. I if they have good pie there. Fiona, don't say that. Oh, sorry, I shouldn't have said that. Damn right. Anna, dead and all. Don't worry. Books are written to entertain, and it's good you're enjoying it. What we're faced with here is a terrible crime committed in a real world. Yeah. Much different from that of a novel. So it's not like one of those fake crimes. Thank you, Agent York. <laughs> Her name is Freckly Fiona. It's incredible. Alright, let's check out the computer room, wherever the fuck that is. No smoking. What are you kidding me? What are you. What are you nuts? Is he going to yell at me for going ahead alone? We couldn't find him. Fiona needs to check her information. No, I don't think so. Looks so like we've got a chess so fan in here. Like playing games by any chance. What do you mean? <laughs> There's a message on the computer. And a card key already set in place. I the think he might be a chess fan. Passes the rook and meets the bishop. The knight takes a pawn along for the queen. What does that all mean? It's a simple puzzle. Zach, let's take him up on his challenge. You can do this, right? Yeah. King passes rook to meet the bishop. Knight takes pawn to the queen. Oh wait, I did it wrong already. Alright, hold on. Okay. Okay. Zach, something is still missing. We need more clues. I got this, I got this, I got this. I could do this. Alright. Checkmate, baby. Even though the king was already killed. 
hole. <laughs> the doctor awaits below with the deceased. Another code? But there's nowhere to insert a password. More games. I'm going to get Fiona to call Usha up here right now. No need, George. The message appeared with the card key. It's telling us where to use it. This is not the time to be joking around, Agent Morgan. Dr. Stop posing at me. Below with the deceased. With Anna. Below being underground, I take it. Simple. Simple. <laughs> Very simple. Then it's time to meet the mischievous architect of this little game. Nah. <laughs> Alright, we got the card key for the underground hospital lab. So frankly. What's your name? Freckly Fiona. It's unfortunate. Sorry to hear it. Where the fuck am I going? My god, even this place is a maze. Do not enter. Oh, here we go. I have not heard of that game, no. But I'm interested just from that description. The hell kind of game is that? It's by the same developer? Kind of a strange turn. Here he is. Hey! It's locked. How do we get in there? I've come, after a long time, I've come to the conclusion cats are superior to dogs, so I'm okay with this decision. After a lot of thought, was he chessing Usha. over there? Sorry to keep you waiting. Ah, you made it. Let's get started, shall we? Hell yeah. I like his chain. This is Agent Morgan from the FBI. Hmm, nice to meet you. I'm Usha Johnson, the doctor in this hospital. FBI Special Agent okay, Francis don't give me York wrong. Morgan. Please Cats. call me York. Let me tell you something. Everyone calls me that. Great. Real Very good. Well, Agent York. Are you a forensic practitioner? Let's just say I've dealt with corpses before. Really? That battle of wits, by the way. Did you create that yourself? Mm-hmm. I just wanted to mm -hmm. see if our FBI agent could handle the task. If he could f just see. put the fucking well, pieces in fun. order. Oh, I'm glad you liked it. Glad you liked following directions. We don't have much time. We need those autopsy results. He's very calm, even though he looks angry. Next time, try challenging us without obstructing an investigation. You've angered the monarch. <laughs> From the onset of rigor mortis, the stiffening of the muscles, the time of death is estimated to be between 20 and 2200 hours. Uh, that's still quite early for such a crime to take place. Note that there are two exterior wounds, pressure marks around the neck, oh, she cried and a, bit. a long cut running from chest to abdomen. And blood marks on her right hand tell us she was gripping something round in her right hand.
Her skull is also fractured, but that is unrelated to the cause of death. It probably happened to her after she was killed. Probably. Now, I first thought death by suffocation due to the marks on her neck. But after further George is a real heel. I now have a different conclusion. A real fricker, if you will. The direct cause of death was loss of blood from the wound. Which means... She was cut up while she was still alive. Man, she's freaking out. She doesn't like that. Yes, uh, a sharp knife was used. It was inserted beneath the sternum and then quickly sliced downwards. The excessive loss of blood from her internal organs is what actually killed her. Oh, wow. Her nails are clean and with no skin cells from the attacker. She also doesn't appear to have been bound <laughs> nor badly church. beaten. Really she isn't. was apparently killed without resistance. The most tragic thing, however, was that she was unable to speak her story to anyone who could hear her cries. How do you know that? She could have whispered it to someone. The perpetrator cut out Hannah's tongue. Oh. Uh... Well, I believe she was drugged first to phase her consciousness, and then the killer killed her. I can't believe the killer killed her. It can't the be. The killer most likely has a deep, traumatized past concerning women. He An insult, perhaps? He converse with them normally. Cutting out the tongue suggests a very lonely individual. Either that, or a truly hardcore sadist. He must get off on watching women suffer, especially when they can't answer back. Now, he watched as the blood pumped from her body, as she gradually grew cold. Now, a case in Seattle. How does he know this? Unless he, he's the killer. Limit your report to your findings as a doctor. Yes. Criminal profiling is my job. <laughs> You're wrong, also. <laughs> Anna died fully, deeply, painfully aware of what was happening to her. Well, the fuck do you know yeah. that? Tell me, what time did it stop raining on the night Anna was killed? Uh, just before I went to bed. Right after the movie on TV. I, I'd wager it was 11, 12 a.m. 1 a.m.? What movie was it? What? American Werewolf in London. Uh, directed by John Landis, 1981. Excuse me. So uh, keep it to the investigation, okay? Movies are my forte. Blue Moon. George, would you mind if I examined Anna myself? Oh, no. What more do you hope to find? Uh, don't leave him with this woman. I'm sure I mentioned that I have a personal interest in cases like these. Oh, no. Oh my god, this angle is weird. She was holding something. Hey. Hi. Yeah, you better turn around. Ooh. <laughs> well, hello there. What am I looking for exactly? Beautiful blonde hair, stunning even in death. Oh. Okay. It's it's nothing that he couldn't have uh, told me. Thomas's biscuit's weird, man. It shouldn't have a hole From in it. From her lack of resistance, I'd say that Anna's injuries happened very quickly. Unable to speak, she was then left to cry herself to death. Zach, it's all starting to come together. <laughs> Why is he saying this? The perpetrator this stayed with her for at least two hours until it stopped raining. How do you know this? At the estimated time of her death, it was still raining but you can still see tear marks on her cheeks. 
Could that be rain marks. She was killed under a roof somewhere. Hmm. hmm. She was then carried into the woods after it stopped raining. Hmm. <clears throat> there, there's one other thing. Her tongue was removed with a very blunt knife. In fact, it's more likely it was simply chopped off. Asha, are you a passionate man? Oh my god. No, not particularly, oh, Asha. But I am man enough should the moment call for it. George, how about <laughs> you? I'm very passionate. Yes. <laughs> Especially when it comes to women. But I don't see what that has to do with anything. George, do you fuck? George, the perpetrator is just like George, you. what's your fuck style? He's passionate about women. He's a passionate kisser. <laughs> this was a kiss of death. Ah, the he kissed her tongue off. Bit off honest tongue. <laughs> yeah, George should have just said, I'm not gay if that's what you're asking. You never get a dental print from a wound like this. Yeah, I'm passionate around women. But this is still a big lead. I have sexual intercourse with women. And also not men. What do you got in there? <laughs> He's getting pretty passionate with her right now. Jackpot sack. A shame, but our old time all American sightseeing tour just came to an end. This case is now under the jurisdiction of the FBI. I'm assuming command. I'll need we got a coffee bean in, the in there. Investigation. What in the hell do you mean, Agent Morgan? I know I said I was passionate, <laughs> but you can't think I did this. That's not why I'm assuming command, George. You're a suspect. What the fuck? You already have a guilty conscience? Why did, why did you freeze it like that? He took over, so he's like, I did not do this. I shouldn't even do his job. Boom, boom. Here's some more, here's some more. What are you fucking doing? There you go. Amazing, huh? I'm sure you have a lot of questions, but most <laughs> Yes, of why do you have all these here. bags of seeds? Can we start there? George, Emily, we should be going. No need to stay here any longer. Okay. I have to sign the release. Just give me a moment. Very well. I'll go on ahead. I can't take it any longer down here. Bishop takes queen. His rook takes your queen. Then your knight takes rook. And checkmate. Huh? Oh. <laughs> I can't believe it. He beat me. He did three moves at once. My first victory in the Grandmaster ranking. I <laughs> know. He just holds the seeds in there. Just the what the fuck? Hmm? Why is this happening again? Okay. Zack, they're here. Welcome back from Europe. Can we buy a bullet here? Wall would pop. Hmm. One single cracker. $35, please. I'm pretty passionate about it. With women! It's a pretty racial game. Black coffee. White crackers. Huh. Pretty racial.
Nothing in there. Got something in here? <gasps> Bullet! Hell yeah! It's a safe place to keep him. <laughs> She's running just like the police officer from earlier. This is a very good game. Playing a game about passion with women and not men. I only shoot butts and punanis. That's it. Is it like this in the regular game, like on console, where you can't aim as soon as it zooms in on a on an enemy? It's a, uh, it's something. It's quite something. You get extra red shots. It's not. I, I wish I could get one, but it's not letting me aim. It lets me aim like this, but then as soon as it uh, zooms in on an enemy, it refuses to let me aim. See? I'm moving my mouse everywhere, but it's just not it's not happening. 13 bucks though, baby. Oof. I wonder if cops actually get paid $13 a kill. Pretty lucrative business. That'd be a good question for someone to ask like during a career day. I've played Deadly Premonition Officer. Is it true you get $13 per kill? Per confirmed kill? See, this guy could almost hit. How, how are you still alive? There you go. Now he's dead. Now he's dead for good. Six of it's a headshot. See, why do we have to put the race of the coffee in here? This is what I'm talking about. Let's start a dialogue here. Neutral coffee. What's under there? Oh, oh wow. Who's under there? Fucking card. Why not just transparent card? That's what I'm saying. Yes. I didn't even aim for the head that time, but I somehow got it. Wasn't there an article about the uh, the inclusion of race in this game? The representation of race in this game? That should be someone's thesis. Love to fucking read that. Why can't I open this? Is, isn't that what the key card's for? Maybe not. get through. Okay. What? Now we got it. Come push it. What? Okay. 
Okay. Oh my fucking- Get out of the way! There we go. The card slot by the door? Oh, that's what's glowing, okay. Thank you. Uh, let's turn that off. Sound like a gun loading. <laughs> oh my god, you are from the US. Holy shit. This guy's an American! Oh, whoops. Now let me change suits real quick. Yes. No problem. No problem. What does that say? Oh. A mission knife! Lollipop. There was this, uh, when I used to go on Yahoo often, they had all these Punjabi animated emotes, and one of them was of this Indian guy who would say, Ooh, lollipop. And I don't know what the context for it was, That that's just all he said. This is the medium? We go from band-aid to full-blown medkit? Part of being a police officer. There you go. I don't like these sounds. This is breaking as I'm pushing it. <laughs> Her. Here, over here. Where? <laughs> he took the first shot before even aiming. That's why I like it. That's what I like about the guy. Very confident. It's very cool. What's in here? Some more band aids. I haven't needed one yet, but that's fine. We'll have them for later. Keep them for later. What's the lore of this game? Uh, a man talks to another man in his head. Asks people about their fuck style. And, um... Drinks coffee. That's about it. I don't know if this... It seems like it is a dream sequence, because he just... This, he just does this for some reason. <laughs> I don't exactly know why. He just likes this. He loves to do this, uh, you know, as it were. What, what am I meant to be doing here? Oh, 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 I got it. Let's hit that escape key a few times. 
He's gaming right now. Yeah, it's like insane, insane. Twin Peaks. Oh, excuse me. Twin Peaks through a really nutty Japanese lens. It's it's almost you know what it is? It's like if you try to explain Twin Peaks to a Japanese person who only spoke Japanese through charades, this is what they would come up with. This is what they would get. Not too sure where these sequences came from, but... Oh! Boss fight? That's inconvenient. I thought that was a vine, but it's just my, uh... It's just my, uh, tie. <laughs> Does he have a gun? Oh shit, they've got guns this time. <laughs> He's very calm about this. Actually, if they shot a gun like that, they'd probably end up on the ground themselves. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. I got one of them. Uh... He's not even using the shotgun. He would have actually had a chance against me if he had used it. Here we go, get some buckshot here. Crotch is the the weak point. You seem to die rather easily as soon as you get that crotch. Is that real? Is that for real? That's a bummer. Okay, I didn't mean to go there yet, but that's fine. I would have been fine with just the investigations. This is, I don't know what the fuck this is all about. Oh, wow, that's a good cookie. That looks like uh, an Entenmann's cookie. It's all dusty and shit. You notice that Entenmann's chocolate chip cookies are really dusty? Like they just turn into sawdust? It's very strange. Also, I'm not sure if the game is still working. Might have crashed. Nothing's happening. Help. Help. What happened? Yeah, it is. I was having trouble with it before. I think it might have crashed. Now I can't get back into the game. Oh, no. The cookie broke the game. I talk shit about Entenmann's and look where it got me. Can you believe this shit? Can I close it? I can't even get on my other monitor right now. Oh boy. And task! And task! Alright. Can't close this. I'm trapped in hell. <laughs> I can't get out of this screen, it's fucking insane. It's completely locked me out of my, my one monitor. Hold on, let me try with task manager one more time. 
All right, task manager isn't even coming up now. Well, that was Deadly Premonition so far. Uh... It's pretty good. I think I'll end it there. Uh, maybe we'll play more tomorrow if it works. I hope this didn't break the save because this did happen last time. I saved the game and then I was unable to get it to work past one FPS. It was impossible. God damn. Yes, the USA stream was short. I'm sorry about that. Oh, but I'll have uh, I'll have another stream for you guys tomorrow. I might even have two. So. Tune in. Thank you for watching, my friends. I hope you have a blessed night. It was a pleasure to stream with uh, stream for you twice. I'll be back tomorrow with either more of this or perhaps something else. And uh, if you're up early, uh, keep an eye out for me. I might I might do an extra stream. You never know. I might stream something goofy. Now I have to turn my computer off. Thanks for watching, everybody. Have a wonderful night.